Using quick lists in your addenda power view is a great way to quickly build a dynamic custom addenda from common phrases or paragraphs that you've previously saved. Because the addenda is essentially just one giant field in total, quick lists behave in a slightly different manner. When you create an addenda quick list, in addition to writing your text exactly as you want it to be saved, you have to first highlight the block of text you want stored. Let's see how it's done. Here you can see that I have a paragraph of text that covers my lack of a conflict of interest in this assignment. To save this so that I can reuse it in a future report, I'm just going to highlight the paragraph using my mouse, then save it in the same manner as we do for field-based quick lists. As a reminder, you can do that by double-clicking the word new next to the number zero, or by pressing alt zero on your keyboard. We'll give it a name conflict statement so we can find it more easily when we want to use it. And here it is at the bottom of our list. Most appraisers will have built up a substantial list of quick list items in the addenda because of the fact that it's all considered one field and is shared across every form type. As a result of this, your hotkeys for using a quick list will only cover the first nine items in your list. You'll be using your mouse for most of your quick list usage here. To make this simpler, try alphabetizing the list by clicking on this button, here. Now, finding your quick list is easy. Let's apply a couple to see how this works. We'll add our revision request and economic life quick list here at the end of our addenda. Notice how they're immediately placed at the exact point of your cursor. So you may need to add a carriage return or other spacing to separate items depending on how you created and stored your quick lists. Using quick lists in your addenda can save you a ton of typing. Give it a try today. For more videos, resources, and information about live events, visit training.alamode.com.